may be the best known furious warriors, the Vikings were likewise the most far extending of martyrs. Those from Norway cruised west to the British Isles, and in the long run over the Atlantic Ocean. To the south, the Vikings vanquished Italy, moving quickly upstreams in huge platoons, fueled by paddle and sail. Dyslexia in captions referred to as explicit issues while reading, surpassing influences an individual's capacity to grasp and compose words in order. Dyslexics experience issues associating visual images with their relating sounds. Numerous individuals who experience the bad effects of dyslexia likewise experience difficulty with articulation, association, and transient memory. The very famous symbol language framework is still being used today, just somewhat adjusted from the earlier first form. It has consolidated images for math, science, and music and has been adjusted to many dialects, incorporating numbers with non-Roman letters in order, for example, Chinese and Japanese letters. People in my country enjoy all kinds of hobbies. One hobby that is very popular now is collecting comic books. They are very popular, and some people try to collect different comics, including storybooks from other countries. People enjoy collecting other things, too, like coins and stamps and other types of things. Some people are very artistic, and they enjoy painting and drawing. Capital of Mongolia, Botor, and London lie at about the same latitude, but Botor is frigid and has only 30 miles of paved roads while London is one of the major centers of civilization. Why do two places, equidistant from the Arctic Circle, have such disparate climates? The Gulf Stream that flows by the British Isles makes all the differences. Nowadays, there's much controversy over regulating immunizations for children. Some people believe that vaccinations should be compulsory for all young people, while others think that it should be the choice of parents. People believe, while immunizations have many benefits, parents should be allowed to choose for themselves if they would like to give these vaccinations to their children. For many people, Lack of sleep is rarely a matter of choice. Some have problems getting to sleep, others with staying asleep until the morning. Despite popular belief that sleep is one long event, research shows that, in an average night, there are five stages of sleep and four cycles, during which the sequence of stages is repeated. There is no right answer for putting your views in the beginning and then explaining the argument during the later part of the essay, or developing your opinion throughout your written work and stating your final stance at the end. Many examiners personally like to state the opinion at the start of the essay. Quickly and clearly, answer the question, making your point clear and sound. Three scholarships of $1,000 will be awarded for the most outstanding students entering the requisite program from each of the countries including Burma, Cambodia, and Vietnam. An additional five scholarships are available for students from many other countries. These scholarships are offered on last week to students in the March and June intakes of the program. Scholarships are awarded on the basis of first-semester results. Burnby College now has full electronic information resources in the college library to help you in your studies. On the CD-ROM in the library, we have over 100 databases, including many statistical resources. If you want to know the average rainfall in Tokyo or the biggest export earner of Vanuatu, it's easy to find out. Whether you are in the School of Business or the School of Art and Design, it's all here for you. The beginners of Icelandic language studies argue that they cannot cope with various pronunciations of the words. Do you know why? Because majority of the words are derived from its Latin origins. And the pronunciation is created by centuries of isolation of Icelandic speakers. 
Social welfare has a special political meaning in the United Kingdom because it refers to how the poor receives financial support. When compared to the benefits in the United States, it has a slightly different connotation to it. Social equality versus the political supremacy, if you ask the common man. Forget what happened in the past. Modern building construction industry has to follow many rules and regulations these days. The floor space index is one of the many basic calculations related to built up land and open space. Construction of windows and entry points are also decided by local council. Who is the most successful person, in your opinion? A laboratory technician who invented a vaccine for the most deadly disease? Or, a car mechanic who ended up creating his own car company? Or, a college dropout that become the richest by creating a social networking platform? Akimbo, the most peculiar looking words in the language, and it puzzles us in part because it doesn't seem to have any relatives. It is now virtually a fossil word, until recently almost invariably found in arms akimbo, a posture in which a person stands with hands on hips and elbows sharply bent outward, one that signals restlessness, aggression, or contempt. Global warming is outlined as an increase in the concentration of carbon atoms in the air that we breathe. It affects the ice-covered poles of our planet more than any other places. It melts the ice, which results in a never-before increase in the level of oceans. It makes smaller islands disappear from the face of Earth. What branch of science is the most important? Finding petroleum reserves was considered the most vital of all as existing sources needs replenishment. To your surprise, modern space science is so advanced that petroleum reserves are discovered from space stations these days. The human brain is the most complex organic machine that exists today. The way it handles various cognitive and analytical processes is breathtaking. The scientists in Japan were able to fit a human brain in a system that regulates complex biochemical processes within an ecosystem. A festival is a means for people to come together. In the ancient society, when there was no festivities, people used to gather around a fire pit and talk in a sign language. Modern festivals are very colorful and they have changed a lot since the Stone Age. However, the social platforms might take us to an age of isolation. Water is essential for our body in a way that it neutralizes our blood and acids in the stomach. Water also helps to detoxify cells and tissues, as well restores normal body temperatures. It was recently discovered that our brain stores information in a soluble form in water. Learning holidays, which combine travel and learning, have become one of the latest new trends in travel. They can give you the opportunity to do something you've always wanted to do, while at the same time truly discovering a country's culture, and they can enrich your life after the trip is over. It is widely agreed that governments of all countries need a stock of money to draw on to pay for infrastructures such as roads and services such as education, defense, or waste disposal. A more contentious issue is whether people should be taxed heavily to pay for these. Of course, one person can do very little to change things around, but the evidence shows that lots of individuals working together can make a big difference and encourage governments to change laws and invest in environmentally friendly campaigns. It is often argued that with so much suffering in the human population these days, it is wrong to use up precious resources on animals. Taking the example of the tiger, Proponents of this view say that to encourage tiger populations to increase in areas farmed by humans, 
would be morally wrong because people's livelihoods would be destroyed for the sake of an animal. Most people believe that computers will play a much larger role in education in the future, but it seems to me that people will always prefer face-to-face -face teaching for some subjects. And we know that many people are employed because students are going to universities for real-life lessons. People initially took care of trees purely for industrial reasons. They had to make sure trees were growing properly so they could be sold and used for manufacturing. The straighter they were, the more high-quality logs could be sawn. But later people came to appreciate trees for more than just their commercial worth. Generally speaking, international sporting events help to inform people about other cultures. However, at the same time sports fans are encouraged by the media to support their own national team. Anyhow, that's an absolute way to enjoy sports and learn new things. People now have a greater awareness of other cultures than was the case even one generation ago. There are undoubtedly benefits flowing from growth in international tourism. Traveling widely to enjoy such things as the art, customs and cuisine of different countries used to be the preserve of the wealthy classes. It's often said that space tourism will be a popular option in the next few years, but in reality, it will take a lot longer than that for it to be affordable for ordinary people. On the other hand, there are many other issues that the world is facing today, for instance, poverty and viral pandemics. It is now becoming clear that pesticides may be damaging beneficial organisms as well as pests. For example, it is widely agreed that the world's bee population is being affected by chemicals, this means fewer plants are being pollinated, which affects food supplies. It is possible, also, that a range of human diseases are becoming increasingly common. Security officials are tasked with preventing criminals from smuggling dangerous materials into a state. But detecting radioactive substances has been difficult and pricey. The Melbourne University researchers have developed new devices based on a low-cost material to aid in the detection and identification of radioactive isotopes. Inventory or stock refers to the goods and materials that a business holds for the ultimate purpose of resale. Inventory is among the more significant sources of revenue for a company. After all, inventory equals profit. So keeping an accurate account of products in stock and inventory to be ordered can have a dramatic financial impact on your business. While it is true that food and garden waste is less destructive than inorganic matter, its disposal is still problematic, especially when buried in vast amounts, as happens in metropolitan areas. Since land is at a premium, landfill facilities almost invariably mechanically compact organic waste, causing acidic reactions in the airless environment below ground. You will be surprised to know that drinking one or more cups of coffee per day is the key to keep your heart healthy. A recent study revealed that caffeine acts as a catalyst in removing the debris in the arteries. However, Drinking decaffeinated coffee did not have the same benefit and may be associated with an increased risk for heart failure. For something so fundamental to our existence, selecting friends remains one of humanity's most imperishable mysteries. For centuries, it has been the topic of intense psychological research. It has been breeding many hypotheses, for example, why we made a particular selection of the group of friends that we have. About 50,000 years ago, North Europe was home to many large and exotic creatures. A new emerging study revealed that the extinction of these creatures was due to climate change, but not due to human activities. The species could not adapt to the fast-changing weather conditions and surviving long winters. Stem cells are the body's master cells, the rare material from which we are built. Unlike normal body cells, 
they can reproduce an indefinite number of times, and when manipulated in the right way, they can turn themselves into any sort of cell in the body. The most versatile stem cells are those found in the embryo at just a few days old. This ball of a few dozen stem cells eventually goes on to form everything that makes up a human. The registered participants in Regional Share Your Ride can sign up to receive daily traffic and weather reports by email. As a participant, you are also eligible for the Urgent Ride Service, which provides you with free transportation to your house in case your car is broken or in case of an emergency. Dragonflies and damselflies are often confused with each other because they are very similar. However, close observation can reveal the differences between them. The most obvious difference is the way they hold their wings while at rest. Dragonflies hold their wings out to the side while damselflies fold their wings back. The library has copy, scan, and print provisions. A universal swipe card is available from the cart vending machine near the checkout desk. Also, there are two laser printers, two photocopiers, and one scanner in the lower library, and one laser printer, and one photocopier in the upper library. Dolphins, whales and porpoises are all social animals, but some species are more sociable than others. This depends on the environment because a species adopts the lifestyle most suitable for this. Among dolphins, forming groups makes it easier for them to find food, reproduce and gain knowledge. They are safer, too, because dolphins can communicate danger when there are threats around. The speaker tells us that clichés are the enemy of literature and art. They are words, phrases and images that have become stale through overuse and therefore have nothing new to say to us. They are an enemy to clear and original thinking, although they are sometimes useful in advertising to get a simple message across. What do we mean by the term intellectual, and what is a public intellectual? It is an odd fact of English culture that it is largely a term of abuse and when asked to name one, we almost always turn to the continent, particularly France. A typical intellectual in France, we think, will hold down a job as a professor, preferably of philosophy. These days you can fit hundreds of books into one ebook reader or smartphone, and this has led publishers, writers and readers alike to ask whether this means the death of the printed book, and a drastic change in how we read. Or, as some hope and believe, will the electronic book format simply complement traditional book publishing? Either way, we are driving us in only one direction, that is future. When computers first appeared on the scene, it was thought they would make us more productive in providing goods and services, smarter and possibly happier. Skeptics claim that the opposite is true as computers have proved disappointing in terms of productivity and have made us less happy and more stupid because information is not knowledge. Is the purpose of history to promote a strong national identity and support national myths? Certainly, it has been used in this way for centuries, and this is often reflected in the history curriculum. We can all remember history at school as being a matter of learning lots of facts and dates, and long lists of kings and queens, a grand narrative of how we got from a not-so-civilized past to the great nation we are today. In the second quarter of the 19th century, a rapidly growing middle class created a great demand for furniture production. Yet at this stage, while machines were used for certain jobs, such as carved decoration, there was no real mass production. The extra demand was met by numerous woodworkers. Mass production came later and the quality of domestic furniture declined. Anthropologists have always disagreed about when and how fire was first used in prehistoric times. Recent findings have now managed to finally persuade them that it was used before they thought, and the principal use of fire was for cooking rather than any other purpose. However, it was the single most important discovery to get things on the right track. In 2010, the European Commission carried out a survey of the European Union's 24 member states. 
the two with the lowest rates of bilingualism, defined as being able to hold a conversation in more than one language. About two-thirds of people in these countries speak only English. It's a similar story wherever English is spoken as the mother tongue. Psychologists have been investigating why people often forget what they came into a room for. Their results suggest that memory operates in a slightly different way than we expect. When information no longer seems relevant, we get rid of it. In this case, the information we learned in one room may seem irrelevant in another room. First of all, to clear up a common misconception, Great Britain refers to the largest island of the British Isles, great in this case meaning big. It is made up of England, Scotland, and Wales, and is the eighth largest island in the world. There are between around 4,000 and 6,289 other islands in the group, depending on the size of rock we are talking about, and whether you can count it as an island if it is only one at high tide. Tsunamis are typically triggered by undersea earthquakes with a Richter magnitude greater than 7. Tsunamis with a shallow focus that create prolonged shocks and move the seafloor vertically are the deadliest. To be more precise, other major catastrophes, such as undersea volcano eruptions, can also cause tsunamis. The avocado is a very special kind of appetizer. It originally evolved somewhere in Mexico or Central America and is now grown all over the world. Avocados are considered healthy because their shape is similar to a part of the human body. One common type of avocado consumed is the variety called the Gwen. The original variety is now harvested in around 70 countries in the world. Recently, some students at the Technical University of Sydney carried out a survey about free time activities and holidays as part of their course. They wanted to find out if city residents enjoy being active in their leisure time. They also wanted to find out which sporting activities are the most popular and if different types of people prefer different activities. How much your holiday costs will depend on which package you can afford. If you want to explore another country or another continent, like Africa or Australia, then you have to travel there before you can start cycling, and that can be expensive. However, Camping can be a way of keeping accommodation costs down. But, generally speaking, you will find there is a cycling holiday to suit every pocket. Bats are the only mammals capable of active and sustained flight. They achieve this with semi-transparent wings, composed of two layers of almost hairless skin stretched between the long bones, the back limb, and the tail. The other external features of bats are not unlike those seen in many groups of other small mammals. They are successful due to their nocturnal lifestyle and other physiological adaptations. Our knowledge of prehistoric rocks and portable art should not be considered either correct or incorrect. But it should only be fragmentary or incomplete. The element of uncertainty is likely to always be present in this field of study. This should lead to flexible models complementing each other and the willingness to accept that scenario. Hay fever is a term that is commonly used to describe a series of symptoms many sufferers experience in the spring and summer. These symptoms generally include sneezing, itchy or watering eyes, a blocked or runny nose, and on occasion, difficulty breathing. Strictly speaking, however, hay fever is not an accurate name for this ailment, since it is neither caused by hay, nor does it cause fever at a high temperature. In 1783, America gained freedom from British authorities and established its own autonomous tea commerce with China. Because of the success of this commerce, some people in Britain questioned the logic of the East India Company's continued monopoly on British trade. The company lost its monopoly eventually to its successor, 
and it was very profitable for traders in India. There are many standards that ensure a safe and nutritious supply of food from organic farms. However, organic farming reduces crop yields while increasing the labor required. As a result, organic food is generally more expensive. The price difference may be offset slightly in the future, as consumers ask for more organically grown produce, and more suppliers jump into the market to fill that demand. Every tribe on the planet has a way of dealing with life's uncertainties. Fortune telling is one example. Some individuals visit a fortune teller if they are interested in their future life or have a major choice to make. These men and women try a variety of ways to assist the consumer with their request. However, the extent to which such ideas are held is frequently startling. Under the new regulations of online shopping, you can change your mind at any time, return the products, and get a full refund, including any shipping charges you may have paid. Whether or not the items have been returned, this must be done within 30 days of the cancellation. Any associated credit arrangements will likewise be terminated as a result. Madagascar's vegetation and wildlife developed in isolation from the rest of the globe for over 85 million years. Many flowering plants are noted for their fragrance, spice, and medicinal uses, which is an example of their entirely distinct essential oils and botanicals. Researchers think that the oil has the ability to penetrate deep into muscle tissue and joints to do significant healing. Hot springs on the sea bottom are known as hydrothermal vents may be found in various locations of the ocean floor, particularly where magma approaches the seafloor. Vent fields are commonly seen around underwater volcanoes when lava is erupting or about to erupt. Hydrothermal vents can also be found in spreading portions of the ocean floor, such as at mid-ocean ridges, where tectonic plates are separating. Reading on paper has become so ingrained in our culture that it's difficult to picture anything ever replacing markings on shredded trees. The written word has proven astonishingly durable since someone discovered an affordable technique to construct movable metal type, making it possible to generate reading matter rapidly and in huge quantities. It may astonish you, but anyone can improve their optimism and faith with effort. Pessimists can have the ability to recognize the positive sides of misfortunes. They can be more precise about the consequences, learn not to take full responsibility, and learn to take credit for the good they accomplish. It only takes a little practice, because optimism is just a method of thinking about the positive and negative aspects of life. The application of advanced technology is redefining the modern architecture industry. Skyscrapers may readily reach unprecedented heights, thanks to technological advancements. It has an impact on how architects design the structures of these buildings. The skyscraper's new function is to give spectacular vistas, as well as to contain communications and telecasting. The 21st century may be remembered as the period of lifelong learning and labor. The end stage of a linear working life, retirement, might be replaced with learning, working, and leisure life cycle. The seasonal, occasional, and project employment are examples of flexible working arrangements that may be used in conjunction with full-time work. The circular shape of a dwelling place allows air and energy to move freely, making it one of the most efficient interior atmospheres for human habitation. This allows natural heating and cooling to take place. Geodesic shelters have been created in a variety of climates and temperatures all over the world, and have shown to be the most effective human shelter available. Dyeing is a method of coloring materials, such as textile fibers, in which the color is absorbed into the garment. 
The color's permanence, or how long it lasts, is determined by the dye and the technique employed. True dyeing results in a permanent color change in which the dye is absorbed by the fiber or chemically mixed with the material. Most people know that Google is creating maps for the entire world. Google Street View started in 2007 with the aim of providing photographs of the streets on its maps. So a user in Tokyo, for instance, can click on a Google map of Paris or Sydney and see what it actually looks like. The photos are taken by cars that simply drive down streets capturing images with a 360-degree camera on their roof. Most graduates hope to find a job that allows them to use the knowledge and skills they learned during their studies. However, it is often the case that many work activities have nothing to do with things studied at university. For most jobs these days, you need to spend a lot of time doing paperwork, which can seem boring, and some jobs involve meeting customers. Poor communication practices within a company can lead to personal conflicts and unsatisfactory work, as well as an incorrect understanding of the business's goals. All of these factors can make staff unhappy and may even make them decide to leave their job. On the other hand, effective communication means there is trust between members of staff, which helps the company produce more and perform at its best. Scientists can quantify haze, but opinions on other types of visual pollution are mixed. Billboards, power lines, cell phone towers, and even modern skyscrapers may elicit a variety of emotions. A billboard in a favorable location may be attractive to a business person. However, it is visual pollution to the tourist who wants to see the hills or the lovely town behind that advertisement. Technology has become an important aspect of life for people who want to get and stay fit. They use apps on their smartphone or other devices, for example, to count the number of steps they take every day, to measure their heart rate, to record their sleep patterns, and to work out how many calories they consume. One of the issues with self-employed persons is that they do not have a large number of co-workers with whom to discuss job duties. As a result, individuals are forced to make significant decisions on their own, which may be quite stressful. Relaxing with co-workers over lunch may also be pleasurable, and self-employed people frequently miss this element of employment. Footballers are not always famous for their intelligence off the pitch, but their mental skills in the middle of a tournament are usually extraordinary. Most people find it hard to imagine successfully doing even something simple while 40,000 spectators watch. Yet every weekend, Premier League players perform brilliantly in packed stadiums under extreme pressure. Most people are amazed to discover that our dependence on nature for health has not reduced. Over the past quarter century, more than half of all the products that drug companies have developed actually use, or copy, substances from the natural world. Moreover, the World Health Organization estimates that in many developing countries, 80% of the population relies on traditional medicines from natural sources. Music is known to have a positive impact on feelings of happiness and well-being. In addition, there is a theory, called the Mozart effect, that listening to classical music makes a person cleverer. Experiments have indeed shown that listening to music has improved language ability in patients with certain illnesses. Electronic devices now make it possible to listen to music on public transport, at work, while exercising, or at any other time during the day. Do you like eating a Cadbury or chocolate? It was created by one of the most remarkable person named George Cadbury. He and his brother Richard had a chocolate factory in the industrial city of Birmingham. In 1879, they were completely out of money. They sold their home for their business. 
After all struggles, good days returned. In this era, the rest apart, their products are sold in almost all countries in the world. The ancient Greeks believed that gold was a combination of water and sunshine due to its brightness, and the Inca kingdom called it the tears of the sun. Gold may not have come from the sun, but it probably did come from another planet. The fact that it is always found near the surface of the earth, which could be possible evidence that it may have been brought here by asteroids. In the 19th century, work for Australia's manual laborers was tough. They worked in areas such as the building and construction trade, or the mechanical and maintenance industry, and their working experiences were represented by uncomfortable and dangerous conditions, fewer payments, and extended hours. This was true until there was a work culture revolution in the 20th century. Surprisingly, unusual science stories in the media soon get noticed. They then get rapidly passed on by social networking sites. The stories that follow were some of the science news items that have recently had us all thinking, oh my goodness, really? They come from a published list of scientific articles that prove to be the most popular on social media, as indicated by the number of likes, shares, and mentions that each of these received. A lot of companies want their employees to be innovative and creative, but how can inventiveness be encouraged? We've all seen those pictures of truly weird offices, with ping-pong tables, swings, slides, even beds. But do they actually lead to greater creativity? It's hard to say. Having fun with colleagues on a slide might make you feel more relaxed and full of imaginative ideas, but then again, it might just be a silly waste of time. Boredom. We've all experienced it, that unpleasant feeling of being trapped in a situation we're desperate to escape from, it's also that desire to fall asleep in a dull lecture or meeting, and it's that need to get out and do something on a rainy day. Boredom has become a fascinating topic for academics in recent years, and studies have shown, it is experienced more frequently and intensely than anxiety, anger, or enjoyment. Some of Germany's biggest companies have brought in rules to protect their workers from being disturbed by work emails outside office hours. Firms such as the car manufacturers Volkswagen have reacted to growing levels of employee stress and burnout by installing software to prevent emails from reaching employees at home. These are all parts of workplace improvements. According to recent research, nearly half of U.S. adults admitted to falling asleep unintentionally during the day, at work, on public transport, or, worryingly, while driving. Twice as many men as women admit to nodding off while driving. In many cultures, having a snooze, though not while driving, is much more culturally acceptable than in the U.S., and it might help to make the road safer. Apparently, a short nap is more refreshing than a cup of coffee. Myths and legends tell of creatures that hunt under a full moon, but the fact is that most animals are actually less active when the moon is at its brightest. Animals that fear being eaten feel safer in the darker nights, and predators are better able than to hunt unseen. Only humans and other primates seem to be naturally more active at full moon. Have you ever wasted a sunny day indoors with curtains closed, by watching your favorite drama series for hours on end? Or gone to bed way too late because you had to watch just one extra episode? If so, you're not alone. Binge watching means watching several episodes of a show at a time is on the rise. According to a recent survey, 91% said they frequently binge watched almost at least once in a week. By the time most people reach middle age, they can probably name a list of things they regret from their past, the job opening they ignored, the relationship that failed, the investment they did or didn't make. 
but the most frequent regrets involve personal matters. According to a new study in which 400 Australian adults, ranging in age from 19 to 70 and from a variety of socioeconomic backgrounds, were asked to describe a memorable regret. The most took some time, and they could not pick just one.